Macaroni, just call name, <laughs> give us name. Who? Well, we, we don't have to give names. The one, what, the one, what have you do? I don't do. The one, the matter what have you talk. Without I saying too about. much, we, yeah. we know the names in our heads without saying too much. Uh, I mean, we, we are very proud of Mr. Macaroni, and just to digress a bit. Yes. Just to digress a bit between you and I. Yes. Forget the viewers. Yes. And when are you contesting? <laughs> between you and I, nobody's yeah, yeah, watching us. Nobody's no, watching no, us. No, between you and I, <laughs> us tell us. Oh my lord! I always say this. I have a PPT ready. <laughs> <laughs> I always say this. I am, I am so scared hmm. of the of Nigerian politics. When I talk about being scared, I'm not talking about oh maybe waiting around do me or no. I'm talking about how the political space changes good people. I have seen great men now become objects of ridicule in society today. Men that we have looked up to, and men, men that made us believe, gave us hope for a better Nigeria. Men that we were looking at and were saying, I want to be like this man. Look, today they have become nuisance to society. So I just, I, I don't know, I just look at it and say, is there a curse? in this space, that as white as your garment is, once you enter that space, it becomes brown or it becomes dirty. So to answer your question, right now, if you ask me right now, I don't know. <laughs> they work what they do now. I'm okay with it. Using my platform, using my voice Absolutely. to advocate for a better country for you and I. Absolutely. For the youths. Advocating for a level playground for everyone, I always say, anytime I get a chance, that there are millions of Nigerian youths that can do better than Mr. Macaroni is doing, if they have the opportunity and if they have the chance. Mm. So what the future holds, politically, I don't know. Right now, it's the same way if you ask me, when am I getting married? Right now, I don't, if you ask me about marriage, I'm not thinking about it. the street. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not thinking about marriage. <laughs> so it's the way I'm not thinking about holding any political. So you just broke some people's hearts right. now. Uh, TV, <laughs> breakfast. Live breakfast on TV. <laughs> so right now, but we'll continue to use our voice, continue to use our platform to um, advocate Absolutely. for a better nation. Fantastic. And do what we can, too, um, to make things better. Fantastic, fantastic. Um, certainly, we cannot all be in politics. I agree. Certainly, we, we we must have lawyers, I doctors, agree. I agree. engineers, entertainers, actors I agree. here and there. I However, um, I, I believe that um, if you're politically inclined, mm. harness that mm. politics in you. Yeah. And everyone is just always saying, well, "Caroni, you are politically inclined." You're no, politi no, no I, I, I'm, I'm not speaking Macaroni right now. Uh, I'm speaking objectively. Yeah, thank yeah, you. Yeah, but no, then, no. because I always, everybody just oh, no, no, because no, no, no. of. The way I am. Activism. Yes. yes. So everyone does it. No, no, it, it. There are two different things. Yeah, yeah. Don't confuse Absolutely. it at all. Yeah. Activism is one thing, mm -hmm. and doing politics is another thing entirely. I agree with you. It will take your time. So everybody, kulu kulu. Good temper. <laughs> when the time is right, eh, we will be behind there. Eh, you, know, you know, we'll be there. We'll be there, certainly. Certainly. <laughs> but, but, but we must all get dirty in that game. Mm. Otherwise, it will never get clean. Hmm. We, we, must, we must all go in we there to wipe get it clean. dirty. Yes. Hmm. That, yes. I think that's part of our problem. We, we must, no, we must all get it. See, there's no how you're hiding. You want to capture a pig mm. to, to eat, for instance. You have to stain yourself a bit. Uh, you, you will just stain you here and there. Yeah, and no. then you clean it. So, so but that's you, the problem. You can, you can for as long style. as we continue thinking that we need no. to um, join them, you know, if we cannot beat them or whatever. If no, no, no. We, no, no. We, 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 we just continue going in circles and going in circles. You know, um... One of our major problems that I think, and how I really think things can be better, is when there are now consequences for actions. I think we're in a place in, in, in Nigeria where there are zero consequences for actions. There's people behave anyhow they want to behave, and so when people break the law or when they offend or when they embezzle and do things that are not right, they know that the next we'll day they well, they'll get away with it. Mm, mm, mm. They get away with it. So I think that's where we need to start from. Absolutely. But, but you see, you see what the problem is for me is that I, a major problem I see in Nigeria is that we have round pegs 
in square holes. Mm. You do not have a right hand in governance. For instance, we, you're having somebody who has worked all his life in NCC, communications, who mm. is now Minister of Sports and Youth. What does he know about sports? I get you. Do you understand? I get you. Yeah. We, we have somebody who is yeah. an SAN, who is yes. the Minister of Works. Yeah. Is is the you culture know. is the culture of um, 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 nepotism? Okay, so let, let's let's take this call real quick. Hello, good evening. Yeah, welcome to PVC Loud. Hello. Hello. Hello, yes, good evening, please. What's your name? Please turn the volume on your TV set, please. Hello, are you there? Okay, please. We lost that call. Yes. Yes, yeah, so you're talking about nepotism, sorry. Yes, it's a culture of nepotism. And that's why, that's why I said we cannot continue that culture. We cannot continue like that because nothing will change. Mm. Because when someone comes in and he believes, oh, these are the people that helped me to mm. get into that particular office, you'll find that he or she mm. wants, is expecting compensation. Mm. Mm. Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello? Hello? Hello, good evening, please. What's good your evening. name, please? Good evening. Good evening, yes. You're welcome to PVC Loud. Small man from Abia State. Small man from Abia State. Small man, good evening, Mama. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm, I'm very, very fine. I'm very much happy joining this program. I used to hear my, uh, Mr. Macaroni. It's my first time of seeing him. <laughs> Hello? Well done. See, uh, what he is saying, I'm telling you, these are the type of people we need in this present dispensation. What he is saying is what we need this time because we need more celebrities to come and educate the masses because a lot of people, they have a lot of followers because the present situation of this country needs people like him, needs people like these people like you, the anchor man, because the question you're asking, you're asking a very pertinent and relevant question. So, to make sure that people educate the uh, people in the villages, telling them the importance of putting in that man that can make this thing happen. Otherwise, before we know this, this is the people, what we are seeing, if you don't properly educate the staff, before you know it, the people that will take over will now lead us to go for the performance pitch of the act. So what we need now is people like my every other celebrities, I go to visually bless you wherever you are going. Because amen, amen. what you are saying has really helped us to know that this time around is no more the time of right, uh, rather right, thought, and <laughs> exactly. uh, stop oh, we again. Exactly. What we need is that person that will change this country and change it for good. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you very Thank much, you. Mr. Mama. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. Which, which is, um, is is part of what, what, what I just said, what, what I'm talking about yeah. now. I can, with what he said, I can, I can trace it back to the culture of vote buying. Mm. When, mm. when a politician comes and offers you 5,000 naira, offers you 10,000 naira, bag of rice, whatever, whatever, because he wants to serve you, someone that is coming to work for you is offering you whatever, plantain, offering you to this, serve you. to serve you. Why? And you should know it is an investment. Hmm. He or she is simply investing and saying, look, because by the time they send five, give 5,000 or 10,000 to how many people? When he or she gets to, uh, gets to the uh, position of authority, he or she will recoup the money. Absolutely. So the money that they are supposed to use, your own money, that they are supposed to use for the it's development better, right? and the growth of the nation is going to their pockets. Hmm. You know, so, uh, okay, <clears throat> another call. Hello. 